Hey guys, welcome back to another video and today we are going to take a look at stable version of Lineage OS 19.1 which is based on Android 12.1 for our Galaxy Note 3. So without wasting any more time, let's take a look at it. So guys, this is the 2013 Samsung Galaxy Note 3 and it is running Android 12 which is Lineage OS 19. Now this is the latest stable build. So let's move into about phone, Android version, you can see Android version 12. Lineage OS 19 and you can see this is a 2nd May 2025 build. Android security patch is also March and you can see this is Android 12 and this is the Easter egg. You can point it out to 12. If I went reverse, it was very. And it shows you the 12 Android 12 and all these bubbles or whatever you can call them. So this is the Easter egg. So guys, previously I have made a video on how to install the Lineage OS 19 on your Note 3. You can find it out here and you can find all the features which are present, all the options and settings present. But right now we are going to talk about all the latest stuff, all the updates and the changes. And the most important change or the thing which has been fixed is RIL, which is uh, your mobile data plus mobile network. So I can see you have your mobile network here and I have my Airtel SIM card. And you can see it says uh, mobile data edge. So obviously uh, it depends on your carrier that if it supports 3G in 2025, mine doesn't. Airtel doesn't support 3G in India. So I have a 2G working and you like your device is not 4G. So obviously 4G will not work. Now let's take a look at all the changes. So let me just bring my tablet. And I will show you all the changes which have been done. So you can see uh capacitive key support removed uh real fixed swap support for the betterment of ram ram management then yeah some cpu stuff you can see power hall these are all the core changes fixed offline charging so if you have uh, issues regarding charging your device uh, when it is turned off then this is also has been fixed fixed deep sleep so when the phone is sleeping the battery drain will be reduced and some other uh, core changes. You can see we have this th third May build, uh, which you can also install. So if you want, it doesn't have a lot of that much like changes, but yeah, some core stuff changes. And I will link you the third May build so you can install the third May build here. But yeah, that is it. Uh, the mobile network is fixed. Offline charging is fixed. Deep slip, which is a main issue regarding battery drain has also been fixed. So this build you can consider a very good stable build also you can use some battery manager which i'm using uh, fx kernel manager and oops and you can use a bot battery monitor and you can also check deep sleep you can see 98 percent deep sleep uh it has uh, given me and yeah the screen off you can see all the stats so the deep sleep uh, issue has been fixed totally also you can see mobile network works fine i have made a call and it works uh, fine it gets the call so yes the most important stuff uh, which all the note 3 users had been waiting for has been fixed so you can now consider this build as a stable build i hope the development of note 3 continues for more long years to come and let's see if we get something new on our note 3 or maybe some other roms or maybe a newer android version then i'll surely make a video and for that to watch it you have to subscribe to my channel so you can subscribe in here also if you guys like the video then press the like button if did not press the dislike button and you can also subscribe which i already do so subscribe for more videos on the galaxy note 3 and other devices that i have and that is it for also for the feedback you can go in the comment section and put the feedback and also thanks to the developers for the immense work that has been done like the Galaxy Note 3 has got a new life in 2025, so that is amazing. So that's it. Goodbye, guys, and take care.